Good morning from the balcony. Are you ready for balcony breakfast? Yeah. We have called room service and had a bounty of things delivered. <laughs> Fruits and yogurts and pastries and granola cereal oh and God. a double sized pot of coffee to sit here overlooking the ocean still. <laughs> we are off the coast of Canada. Well, it's on the other side. This is just the ocean. I am ready for some chilly weather breakfast. It's not actually that cold out here. I just wanted to wear my balcony hat and it looks good, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna enjoy some breakfast with my balcony hat on. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. What is wrong with you? you I'm trying great. to be professional. You look great. I'm just wearing warm. <laughs> Why are you meeting with my balcony hat? <laughs> it's not cold. It. No, it's really not. It's like still 60s uh, or something, I'd say. Oh no, what happened? No spoons? Uh oh. I guess we'll just hmm. slurp it no. down <laughs> out of the side of the bowl. There you go. Mmm. Mm. Nailed it. Good morning, officially. We didn't, well, we said good morning on the balcony. Yeah. But we are jammed full of breakfast now. We've sat here and watched the waves enough, so mm -hmm. we're going to get out and explore. Do some stuff. It was supposed to be Sitka Day today, as we said, yeah. but it's a sea day. So we're going to go do some stuff we might have done in Sitka, like <laughs> shopping. Yeah. Yeah. There's some sales and it's stuff a going on. Deck sale. Yeah. Let's, let's go buy out. a deck. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on. Happy Yadson do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Have a little wander through the bird laden solarium out here to see if the deck is for sale. So, deck 11 is advertised as the deck sale. Yeah, this kind of just looks like a pool and some chairs. Maybe the chairs are for sale. Ah, oh. aha, we've located it. They put it over here under the cover, which makes sense. Oh, I see. It looks like we're sort of forming a line, and then you get to go through the table as a line. So it's an organized deck sale. I like chaotic deck sale, personally. <laughs> no. no. It's like we've got all kinds of accessories, destination t-shirts, two for 20, little hats and gloves down there. We got some coats and vests and sweatshirts and things too. Well, we have determined we didn't really need anything at that particular shop. We might run through the ship shops or, uh, later, the ones that are down on deck five, but we saw the coffee station. Juices, waters, coffees. None of that fancy enhanced water though. I opted for a delicious Alaska orange juice. <laughs> Alaska is known for their orange production, just in case you didn't know that. A lot of citrus coming out of Don't Alaska. Cheers. Well, <laughs> let's have a little wander to the inside now on deck 11, I think. Oh. <laughs> He's singing away back there. <laughs> a windjammer fella is singing away back there. Have a little peek down the centrum. Yeah, I like that. Uh huh. Peek throughs on the side. Cute. Yeah, I'm sure when they do like big old parties and stuff in the atrium, because I don't know if this is a class of ship where they ever have aerial type stuff. That might not be this class. No. Yeah. Grandiosity. True. Yeah. Now, one thing we might have done in Sitka we don't know is climb a mountain, so we figure let's climb up to Deck 12. We haven't explored Deck 12 yet. We hey, a shovel. Cool. Here's where we can see where we are right now. Oh gosh, what happened? Okay, well, we <laughs> left Seattle and we've gone up to the mystery territory that apparently oh. no one knows about. Wow, that's sad. We are discovering Alaska for you guys. No, even up here, wow. it's gone. No one knows anything about Alaska. <laughs> so over here we've got fuel, which I think is the teen area. We also have royal babies and tots. I love tater tots. And we have outside. Face mask freezing. So we do have some land in sight off this side of the ship. I think this is a little island, I forget the name, off the coast of Canada. We're just <laughs> getting ready to pass into like Alaska type territory up there. You might not survive up here on deck 12. It's a little too chilly for you. It's just windy. If it wasn't so windy, it wouldn't be like cold. True. Chilly. Well, let's wander to the aft and check out the sports court area. 
<laughs> Let's see how long until she realizes that that's the front of the ship up there. Ah! <laughs> she heard go and got excited. <laughs> All right, let's let's head let's head aft. So we got some games. Hey, there's additional deck chairs back here. I know you can play all sorts of colorful games. So back here we have something that they call Adventure Beach. Okay, I was wondering if this might be like a splash park or something like that. Don't think we're having splash park day today. Ah, rock wall up on thirteen. We might make our way up there. Yeah, this this is not going to be a highlight of the Alaska cruise. <laughs> Pretty sure it's not going to be open at all. But that's cool. <laughs> so they do. Yeah, they do actually have a water slide. I did not know if they had one back here. No, I feel like maybe anybody could go down it. Basketball. Yeah, we'll read the rules, but I'm thinking an adult can go down there. Explorer's Club door. We're not really exploring in the kids zones right now. Voyagers. Oh, Dean's going to play basketball. And now it's time for Sport Mode D again. Help me. Can she do it? First shot. Yeah, Nothing but net. Oh. Well, that, that was nothing but net, but it was the outside of the net. You do a lot better than I would, though. It all comes down to this. The game is tied. It's the, oh, it was the winning shot. You got that winning free throw. Try. I don't know if I could dribble a ball. That's yes, you can. Just try. Okay, more than once, you have to you know, catch it. I thought once was impressive. Look at you, sports mode. Okay. That was great. Go get it again. That was a very supportive laugh. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was good. Two-handed granny shot. Do it. Right, here we go. Oh. A little further. You hit the rim. <laughs> now it's time for a little soccer action. Oh, mercy. I don't. I think you're trying to get in my goal, and I'm pretty sure I'm trying to get in your goal. But you're probably gonna win. All right. Oh. Choo, choo, choo. Hot feet, fast feet. Look, <laughs> we have to stay inside the net. Oh no. Soccer ball escape. All right, that's it. I'm gonna get you. Oh yeah, dribble. I can dribble this ball. Look, all I do is follow it. Boom. How dare you block my shot? Oh yeah. <laughs> Got it. Yes, out of bounds. This is terrible. All right, here she comes. Kick. Oh, she kicked me in the knee. This is why we don't record sports footage. Yeah, that's right. Steal the ball. Oh, goal. 1-0. Yeah. Oh, that was right in the knee again. I'm going to have to go to the medical center. I'm going to put you on a timeout bench. Fast feet. How do I steal? Oh. Right in the ankle. <laughs> this is a violent game. Apparently, I'm not cut out for the physical abuse that is soccer. That's <laughs> it. We're I, I knew mercy. We're done sporting. That was too much. Get a goal. All right. Well, I'm just gonna have to move out of the way and let you have a goal. Okay. Unguarded goal. Here we go. Yes. <laughs> we tied one-one. We'll call it a draw. Oh, this is more my speed for sports, the video arcade. Oh, got to put masks on, that's right. Nice. Oh, they got the little prize hub. I need a Pikachu hat. Oh, that's, I'm pretty sure that's Wonder Woman socks. Not WWF socks, but maybe. That's cool. So they got the thing where you get the tickets and you can get prizes. Look at all this. Nice. Cute little small arcade. That's fun though. Yeah, they got sanitizer every station. Well, maybe not the ducky station, but still, most every station. Wipes on some of the other games. Oh, yeah, I see. So you can't play this one, but that one's fine. And then you can't play that one. You can't win Mario. You watch me. 
Stop it. You better follow the rules. Sanitizer on <laughs> I'm going to call the sports supervisor office on you if you try to use a machine that's no good or if you kick me in the knee again with a ball. Back to the outside. We have found the aft of the ship. Yeah, just plop, plop, plop right down the stairs. I guess that takes you back down to Windjammer on 11. Look at all this Alaskan wake. Now we're technically looking at Canada over there still. Oh, Canada. <laughs> hey, Izumi. So if you want all your sushiing food needs, apparently this is where you go. So there is the Izumi entrance. Ooh, what do you actually eat at Izumi? We have never been. Small plates, large plates. I'll have a large plate, please. Okay, yeah, so it's it's a la carte. Mm -hmm. I guess they. Oh, there's a mask. We did have a little prefix option in the corner. It said for like thirty-five dollars, you can pick out a few things, or it's a la carte. But I don't think we're doing that this trip. Anyway, let's go look at some mini golf. Fairways of Serenade. Very cute. Is this? person with a dog so I guess this is kind of like a nautical themed that seems to be what they do nautical themed mini golf yeah. very windy up here we'll see how the microphone does yeah some folks are out here playing right now I don't know how many holes there are I would guess about nine that's just me guessing though you got that cruise hair don't care uh, it's real. <laughs> <laughs> they've got all the equipment out here with wipes to wipe them off yourself are you? You're yeah, the ship is moving. Just off frame, falling. Oh, all right. Let's roll. Okay, let's go. Yeah, a few more holes over on this side. Let's go somewhere where it's less windy yeah. and chilly, perhaps. <laughs> let's go across the bridge and look at the rock wall. I didn't really spy any rules about the slide, whether it was for kids or adults or whatever. Oh, the wind. Hey. Nice big rock wall. I did see um, hours advertised for the rock wall, so it is running sometimes. There's like, a two hour session in the morning, afternoon, and evening. Okay. Well, yeah, we just tried to go in that door. <laughs> Apparently, that one does not work. A gentleman on the inside signaled to go down the deck and go in. Back down on 12, we have lots more colorful games. We've wandered up to deck 13 now. Oh, yes, Vortex Nightclub is up here. I know the Diamond Lounge is around here somewhere. Cool. And this is a vaccinated guest area, which usually means masks are optional. Oh, they've got the art auction stuff set up in here right now. There's a little bar in here. You've got the overlook to the pool. Guess we won't wander over there right now. And here's where they keep their D's. So I guess I'll just settle in here. We're looking for whales out here in the wild. Crikey. I don't know if anybody spotted any up here today, but apparently you can. This is not a whale. This is a light reflection, so we'll see what we see. Ma'am, that's not okay. It's working. <laughs> what are these cows in here on 13? That one's in well, there so long, there's an island on it. Goodbye, cows. <laughs> We're going to head down to deck 16, Ooh, or deck water. 6, oh wow, for a trivia we have no chance of winning, but hey. <laughs> Whoops, that's 7. That is cool. Oh, Schooner bar time. I think this is called Where in the World Am I Trivia, so... Hmm. <laughs> Maybe if it has to do with cruising destinations or something, but it could be like, recognize that flag and I would be terrible. Good day in the morning, there was not an available table at the schooner bar. I guess that's about one of the only things going on. People were playing cards, and they've got so many blocked off for social distancing, there was not an empty seat in the house. So good thing we had no chance of winning. So we didn't win, because we didn't play. <laughs> but anyway, we're wandering. Little Henry, good morning, Henry. We've come back to the cabin for a bit, and he looks so happy to see us. What is this little guilty goose doing over here with my hairbrush? <laughs> um, <laughs> he looks real guilty. You don't even have any hair, sir. Uh, we never really had a steward who liked to play with props. So that's kind of funny. Mm -hmm. I heard 50 people say they saw a of whale this morning, so I'm going to find it. Yeah, something. I know. So we are not on the Canadian mountainside. Yeah, that was funny just walking around here and people be like, yeah, I saw some whales this morning. We're like, gosh, we need to be looking better. Hmm. We are on the move again. It is lunchtime. We're going to go hit up Windjammer for some lunch. 
That grill station looked delicious the first day, so we're hoping for some salmon and some Asparagus. stuff. I know, we just got... We've like built up this meal in our head. We have. I think it's not going to happen now. Well, salmon maybe. <laughs> I'm questioning asparagus, but I, I could use some asparagus right now. <laughs> Whee! Up, up, and away. A little windy on the wind jammer. These are the grab and go offerings. Ooh, they might have to put the dressing on for you actually. Curried rice and baby shrimp salad. We have some crudite, Caesar salad, coleslaw, and a cantaloupe smoothie. So on the main line, we've got pork, schnitzel, roasted garlic, and rosemary chicken. There's a baked pasta with seafood, some spaghetti. Whoa, some kind of a dish with pork and shrimp. Fried noodles, tandoor chicken, stir fry vegetable. Oh, good stuff. This other side, what it says they have gluten free. I guess that means their beef stroganoff is gluten free. We've got some stuff with, oh, that's a fish with the tomato sauce, zucchini, garlic, corn, parmesan fritters, potatoes, mushrooms. What appears to be spinach, mashed potatoes, burgers, dogs, and pizza as always. Cheeses and meats and things here in the middle. I do want to go check out the grill station. Ah, it's a stir fry station today. We got stir fry shrimp, chicken, and beef, and some fruit, and of course, desserts. Now we struck out on the salmon front, but we did get some tandoor chicken. I ended up with fried noodles, mashed potatoes, a little veggie frittata. We got a lot of chicken happening over there. Chicken, potatoes, spinach, caprese, and crudite. All right, well, that's a start. I might go check out some of the stir fries too here in a minute. I had to make another run back up there and visit the stir fry station, stir fry shrimp and stir fry beef, a little bit of pork schnitzel, barbecue chicken pizza, and a curry rice and shrimp salad, because why not? I went all over the place. Let's see what's up for dessert. Coffee cheesecake, which is a gluten-free, no sugar added, matcha cream puff, cherry pie, all kinds of stuff up here. Chocolate bar, panna cotta, pecan pie, red velvet cheesecake. So we have gone with chocolate soft serve, of course, and I got a chocolate bar and some chocolate chip cookies. There seems to be a chocolate theme here. Now we can have some pool time. Are you ready for pool time? Not right now. Not Thank quite. We'll just have a wander in here into the solarium. Oh, solarium spin, apparently. Any whales to report? Sadly, no. So we're sitting here now, just gazing off into the ocean. It'd be nice to have a cup of coffee to sip on while just sitting here looking for- There you go! Wow! There's sugar in it. I'm just like- Ooh, actually I can drink black coffee sometimes, oh, but- Look at that. Thanks, ma'am. You're welcome. <laughs> This is the perfect spot to whale watch though. You're inside, it's just warm enough. There's delicious roast beef sandwiches back there in case you need them. It's right here in the solarium by the park cafe. You heard it here first, coffee as well. <laughs> we just got reports from some folks that they saw a pod of orcas like 15 feet from the ship off their balcony. Why are we missing all these whales? What the heck, we're trying. I don't even know what to say about that right now. I know. Well, sing to them the song of their people. If you sing the song of their people, no. they might come. I'm in south with 50 people. I'm not That's you. That's you. Oh. <laughs> oh, we got a note. We do have a note. What the heck? Are we in trouble? Experience the last excursions that showcase the best of Oh, gosh. Now we've returned to the cabin to continue the hunt for whales because that's what you do today. There was a movie at two o'clock. The Quiet Place too. Mm -hmm. But I realized I can watch that on the um, airplane on that's the way home true. if I really want to see it. Because the seats in there are not the most comfortable for long periods <laughs> of time. So this is what we're doing because there's literally nothing else going on. Nah, there's a few random trivias, bingo. there's live music, there's bingo, and that's really about all that's on the schedule. So much yeah. more subdued than your standard cruise. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I got a lot of work done, and then Jay can start editing. I guess that's true. Or editing, Jay can start editing. That's right. I'm going to take a nap, so whatever. I'm, I'm going to chill on get binoculars and look at nothing. Sounds good. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. <laughs> oh, I no. just locked it. I did just lock it. Okay. Your whales need you. Wait. How are you ever going to make it out okay, there? Oh, a there's a child lock on the balcony. Who ever could have... <laughs> He's not as fun as you think he is, guys. <laughs> Whoops.
D has there officially is. espied yeah. a whale in the distance. It's like exactly where I'm pointing. Oh man. See, there's its arm. Look at those whale arms. Yeah. Look. I'm so happy again. First whale sighting in the ocean. Oh wow, I do see him that time. Which is trivia, trivia. This is better though. That's true. If this whale keeps popping up, we'll say forget 90s music trivia. You know we can do some I 90s music know. trivia. We have a ton of keychains at home. <laughs> Hello. 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 Wow. Yeah, I think our neighbors all ran away. They were like, mm-mm. We had one or two neighbors, and I think they're gone now. There he is. Oh, way out there, yeah. There's two. Well, of course, the more you talk to them, the more they come. Um, oh, look right here, look right here. Very close to the ship. Right here. Okay. You see him? Where's my key? It just came up and puffed. See this I, water I disturbance right there? That was super close. Oh. Look at him. <gasps> That is so close to the ship. I mean, I'm talking like a hundred feet from the ship, probably. Mm -hmm. Yep. All, all of a sudden, I heard poof, poof, and I said, "Oh my gosh!" Look, there he is, puffing again. All right. I don't think we need '90s music trivia anymore. We're like, forget this. We're apparently in prime whale country. Yeah, just look at him going nuts out there. Oh, this is daggone exciting. She said, don't look at all her spaghetti hair. Oh, she, she, she just got done just curling, curling it. Mm -hmm. That was super close. We're, we're going to probably stay out here a little bit because obviously we're in a good zone right now. This is the best. I'm looking ahead to see if any are coming up close to the ship and she's looking behind with the binoculars once we confirm <laughs> sight them. Wow, we definitely got a little bit of footage there though, especially of that one that was up. It's about 100, 150 feet from the ship. Somebody said they saw one 15 feet from the ship. Now, one man's foot is a different, it's not the same as every man's foot, you know what I mean? 15 feet. That would have been really close. Um, go all the way over here. Yay! They said the evening is a better time to see whales. Actually. Okay, it's, it's like 3.30 right now, but maybe the whales, maybe the whales, oh. what is all that? <laughs> this just looks like a bunch of sparkly, what's all the, it's just the sun catching the water, I guess. That was really weird. Anyway, I got distracted. And maybe the whales are on Eastern time, so they already <laughs> think it's later than it is. Hi. Yeah. And another confirmed sighting in the distance. I'm an excellent whale. D is giddy as a schoolgirl. Oh. Yeah. Oh, nice. We just sit here and listen to you squeal and giggle about whales. That's awesome. I don't even have my camera because they're too far. I know. You, yeah. I don't have to do this No, you, ju you just enjoy them in your binoculars. Big back. Big back. What's the orca? Yeah. All these big back whales in their arms. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Don't come to me for technical terms of animals. We're not going to let you do any whale seminars on the ship. <laughs> Like guys, just go outside and look for their arms, and you'll see their big back, and it'll be great. That's why we don't need to do any trivias. They're flocking to you. They're like, D is here. We haven't heard her in. It's been over two years since we heard her voice. Getting to the point in the day now where the sun is going to start creeping below the horizon. That means it's almost time for dinner. Heck yeah. I'm so hungry. Hi, hey, now. It is dinner time. Finally. And that means we're going to dinner. Yeah. We put in a standing reservation with our service team, which mm -hmm. we have loved in the dining room. They're amazing. And it seems like 7.30 is the go-to slot, so. It's all right. Best things come to those who wait, right? Sure. Yay. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right. Wait for food. <laughs> no, they're very fast, actually. They are. Yeah. All right. Bye. Got the band playing down in the lobby. Centrum, I guess, is the word. No, she hasn't started singing yet. No, it's not my fault. <laughs> 
There she goes. Bread rolling. Check out all this menu action. Look at all this shadow action, actually. They have brought us out our traditional fruit plate. I guess this is our this is also our standing order now. So it's like we get the fruit plate without ordering it, and we typically get ice cream and cookies at the end of the meal also without ordering them. <laughs> They brought a banana split as the extra dessert tonight. <laughs> you know that's perfect. Uh, we are full. Oh my gosh, they spoil us. Anyway, we're heading back. There's a little trivia going on. We're gonna kill some time before the show tonight. Just see what this trivia is all about. Safari Club. This should be a nice big venue. Visual trivia, famous couples. All right, this is gonna be D's quiz. Well, if it's movies, you you know your movie folks. D makes a good point. This could be like historic couples. This could be any kind of couple. It could be us. We could be on this quiz. We are pretty famous. <laughs> we are so not. Uh, the first couple. It's coming. Who is this famous couple? Fifteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Nineteen and a half. Nineteen and a half. Heading up front now. Go to the main lounge. Got a show going on. See if we can make it through the casino. Oh, I hear some pub guitar going on. We are about 40 minutes ahead of showtime, so we're just gonna find a spot to hang out. So this is Solitary Man, a tribute to the music of Neil Diamond, actually performed by our cruise director, John Blair. And he is hiccuping. Nice. already had a towel animal today. We had Sassy Goose or whatever his name was earlier. Sassy Goose. Turned him into Sassy Seals, it looks like. There's two of them in this Oh, girl. Man. Boy. Wow. We Look got our here. cruise compass and everything for tomorrow for Sitka. I feel bad taking these guys off the bed. I don't think we've ever gotten two. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to bed. Sleep time. It's like 10.30. His show was a little longer than mm -hmm. uh, the other ones. It was think, really good, though. He was good. I know. Yeah. I realize I know more Adele songs than Neil Diamond songs, Me but too. I knew a lot of Neil Diamond songs. I think I knew like three of them. I know more. He just didn't sing the ones I know. That's oh. it. <laughs> he sang most of them. Anyway, but we are heading to bed. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow is our first port day, finally. We're going to be in Sitka. And it's supposed to be nice weather. Yes. So that's good. It's supposed to be the one nice weather <laughs> port we have for the cruise. We'll see. Anyway, good night, y'all. Come back good tomorrow night. for more fun. Mountain. Yeah. Tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, finally. Bye. Bye.